In this video, we are going to learn addition and subtraction of rational expression having unequal denominator. You can see here the denominators are unequal and we have to rationalize, we have to simplify it. Uh, let's take a start. First of all, we have to take LCM, but before taking LCM, we have to look at the factors, either they are same or not. You can see here, x minus 3 is here, here also x minus 3, yes, these two are same. Here is x plus 2, another x plus 2 is here, okay, these two also same. You can see here, here is x minus 4, but here is 4 minus x, but we can make it same. So, better to convert this one and convert this in the form of x minus 4 by taking minus common now look at here how to take common we have to write on same x minus 3 x plus 2 when you take minus common from here this plus will be minus and we can write here x by plus 2 and here we can interchange this s minus 4 i will show you again how it came 2 by x minus 3 and x minus 4 now you can see here also x minus 4 here also x minus 4 so it's easy to take LCM now uh, you can see here 4 minus x when you take minus common we can interchange this two we can write here x minus 4 because minus into x minus x minus minus plus 4 so when you take minus common we can interchange it and this minus and this plus minus plus it will be minus and we can write x minus 4 which is here hope you understand this one after this we have to take lcm and what is the lcm first of all we have to take common common x minus 3 x minus 3 we can write here x minus 3 afterwards we can arrange in ascending order here is x plus 2 x plus 2 so we can write here x plus 2 similarly x minus 4 x minus 4 so we can write here x minus 4 we can take here common and remaining we don't have any remaining just we have a common so lcm is x minus 3 x plus 2 x minus 4 now we have to divide the denominator you can see here x minus 3 x minus 3 these two cancel when you divide these two cancel they have same factor so cancelled x plus 2 x plus 2 this also cancelled what is remaining x minus 4 we have to multiply by 1 so 1 into x minus 4 what we can write here x minus 4 only by multiplying by 1 it will be same here is minus minus 3 is here so 3 we have to write okay now we have to divide the denominator and whatever remaining we have to multiply by 3 here is x plus 2 x plus 2 when you divide these two cancelled yes x plus 2 x plus 2 cancelled here is x minus 4 here also x minus 4 so cancel this also cancel this also cancel what is remaining x minus 3 we have to multiply by 3 so we can write here 3 x minus 3 here is plus so plus we have to write down now again we have to divide the third term uh, we have to divide this denominator of third term x minus 3 x minus 3 this two cancel these two are same factor so cancelled here is x plus 2 here we don't have x plus 2 okay x minus 4 x minus 4 cancel so x minus 3 cancelled x minus 4 cancelled what is remaining x plus 2 we have to multiply by 2 so we can write here 2 x plus 2 okay up to here after this open the bracket what we can write here x minus 4 minus 3 into x 3x minus minus plus 3 into 3 9 plus 2 into x 2x plus 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 2 into 2 4 by we can write this in the uh, in first we can write here 2 then we can write here 3 then we can write here 4 so first of all write on x plus 2 let's arrange this first 2 then 3 then 4 then x minus 3 and then x minus 4 after this here we have to add and subtract the like terms let's do it here is x here is minus 3x here is 2x okay first of all we have to add 2x plus x 3x so we can write here 3x here is minus 3x write down minus 3x and after that number here is positive 4 here is negative 4 uh, negative 4 here is positive 4 so we can cancel this two and what is remaining plus 9 so we can write here plus 9 and after that denominator we have to write down same and we can write here x plus 2 x minus 3 and x minus 4 hope you understand up to 
here again you can see here positive and negative and positive we can cancel here 3x minus 3x it will be 0 and what is remaining here 9 so what we can write here 9 by how much this denominator x plus 2 x minus 3 x minus 4 this one is the answer hope you understand this fiction now look at next and the next question is x minus 1 by 2x minus 1 this is the question so first of all we have to look at here is common elements or not if not we have to arrange and make it here is 2x minus 1 you can see here here 1 minus 2x so we can write this 2x minus 1 if you interchange this two in the place of plus what we have to write on minus okay here is x plus 2 x plus 2 we have here is x minus 1 but here what is here 1 minus x again we have to interchange it means both we have to interchange from here we get 1 minus here from here we get 1 minus 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 plus okay if only one we if only one factor if you change then you have to change this positive into negative if both you are going to change then from here minus we will take common from here we will take minus common then minus minus plus so this one it will be plus only let's take a start so we can write here x minus 1 by 2x minus 1 and here x plus 2 similarly plus 3 by x plus 2 x minus 1 here we have to write down plus 2 by we have to write here x minus 1 and here 2x minus 1 from here minus common taken from here minus taken minus minus it will be plus so this one no need to change only one factor if you change only if you change this only then in the place of plus we have to write down minus like first number which we done before this question now we can take here LCM and what is the LCM first of all we have to take common here 2x minus 1 2x minus 1 so we can write here 2x minus 1 after that x plus 2 x plus 2 so x plus 2 we have to write only one time don't write x plus 2 again x plus 2 if common we have to write only once here is x minus 1 x minus 1 we can write here x minus 1 is there any other factors which is remaining we don't have any factors so lcm is 2x minus 1 x plus 2 and x minus 1 now what we have to do we have to divide the denominator this and this denominator we have to divide so 2x minus 1 2x minus 1 cancelled x plus 2 x plus 2 also cancelled what is remaining x minus 1 we have to multiply with upper one now you can see both are same x minus 1 x minus 1 so what we can write here x minus 1 whole square we can write okay it is plus so plus again we have to divide the denominator x plus 2 x plus 2 cancelled yes when you divide so this two cancelled x minus 1 x minus 1 also cancel what is remaining 2x minus 1 what whatever is remaining here we have to multiply by 3 so we can write here 3 2x minus 1 it is plus so plus we have to write down after that uh, now again we have to divide the denominator x minus 1 x minus 1 cancelled 2x minus 1 here also 2x minus 1 cancel what is remaining x plus 2 remaining yes we have to multiply by 2 so we can write here 2 x plus 2 hope you understand up to here now we have to open the bracket yes here this in the form of a minus b whole square we have to use formula a square minus 2 a b plus b square plus 3 into 2 6 x plus minus minus 3 into 1 3 plus 2 into x 2x plus 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 2 into 2 4 and denominator we have to write on same you can arrange also first of all we have to write x minus 1 then x plus 2 and then 2x minus 1 or you can leave up to here also your answer will be correct okay up to here. now let's solve this upper one what we can write here x square minus 2 x plus 1 square 1 we can write after that plus 6 x minus 3 plus 2 x plus 4 by x minus 1 x plus 2 and 2 x minus 1 now what is the answer we have to uh, first of all we have to arrange like terms add and subtract like terms here is 2x here is negative 
positive 2x here is negative so we can remove it after that here is x square we don't have any x square so we have to write on x square here is 6x so we can write here plus 6x and after that number 1 is here 4 is here 4 plus 1 5 and 5 minus 3 2 so we can write here plus 2 by denominator same we have to write on and what is the denominator here x minus 1 x plus 2 and 2x minus 1 so this one is our answer so answer is x square plus 6x plus 2 by x minus 1 x plus 2 and 2x minus 1 very interesting simplify we have which is in front of you you can see here a by a minus b a minus c and b by this is the question so this you can see here in denominator a minus b a minus c b minus c always we have to convert in this form a minus b b minus c and c minus a if not we have to take minus common and we have to arrange in this form always here you can see a minus b which is we have here a minus c but what we need here c minus a so we have to interchange while interchanging what we have to do we have to take minus common and when you take minus common in front of this we have to write down minus so we can write here here we can write here minus and here a minus b and here we can write c minus a so when you take took minus common from here this here will be pos negative and we can interchange this again you can see b minus c which is we have here is b minus a but what we need here a minus b so when you interchange this it means we are taking common like this you can see here b minus a when you take minus common what will happen a minus b because minus into a minus a minus minus plus b so this minus and this plus plus minus it will be minus only b by and in the place of b minus a what we can write here a minus b so b minus c write on b minus c and here we can write a minus b again c minus a which is already we have here c minus b but we need b minus c so we have to interchange we have to take minus common from here when you take minus common this positive will be negative and we can write here c minus a and here b minus c hope you understand up to here after this we have to take minus common here minus 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 so let's take minus common it will be easy to solve it so we can write here a minus b c minus a so plus we have to write on because minus is common so we have to change the sign minus plus it will be minus so if minus we have to write plus if minus we have to write plus but if plus we have to write on minus here b minus c a minus b again in the place of minus we can write here plus c by c minus a b minus c now finally we have to take lcm and what is the lcm while taking lcm always first of all we have to take common that's why we make here same here b my a minus b here also a minus b so we can write here a minus b after that b minus c b minus c common common factor common element so we can write here b minus c after that c minus a c minus a yes so we can write here c minus a now we don't have any remaining factors so lcm is a minus b b minus c c minus a now what we have to do we have to divide the denominator denominator we have to divide it a minus b a minus b cancel c minus a c minus a cancel what is remaining b minus when you divide this two denominator a minus b a minus b cancel these two are same so cancel c minus a c minus a cancel what is remaining b minus c we have to multiply by a so we can write here a b minus c okay here is plus so plus again we have to divide the denominator b minus c b minus c cancel a minus b a minus b cancel so what is remaining c minus a we have to multiply by b so we can write here b c minus a similarly here is plus so plus now last one divide it c minus a c minus a cancel these two are same factor so cancel b minus c b minus c also cancel what is remaining a minus b is remaining multiply by c so we can write here c a minus b after this open the bracket and we can write here a into b a b minus a into c 
AC or CA you can write anything plus B into C BC plus minus minus B into A AB or BA you can write anything plus plus C into C into A AC or CA write anything no problem plus minus minus C into B BC and after that here A minus B B minus C C minus A now you can see here we can cancel here positive and negative here a b is positive a b is negative after that here a c is negative here a c is positive again b c is positive and here b c is negative nothing remaining what we have to write on zero by a minus b b minus c c minus a zero divided by any number any factor which is zero so answer of this simplification is zero hope you understand this question now look at next here we have another question very interesting here also x minus y x minus z y minus x y minus z okay uh, always we have to if the like question is in this pattern always we have to convert in the form of x minus y y minus z and z minus x either we have to take minus common now you can see here 1 by x minus y which is we here here is x minus z but here we have z minus x so we have to convert this to convert this we have to take minus common while taking minus common this positive will be negative and we can interchange this so we can write here x minus y here z minus x i show you before also how to convert this now here y minus x but here we need x minus y so we have to interchange this y minus z which is here so here we have to write on minus and here we can write x minus y and y minus z similarly here z minus x which is here here is z minus y but we need y minus z so in the place of positive we can write here negative and we can write here z minus x and here y minus z hope you understand up to here after this you can see all three terms are negative it's better to take common first of all and after that take LCM it will be very helpful for us to, to solve it x minus y x minus z so in the place of negative we can write here positive 1 by x minus y y minus z again in the place of negative we can write here positive 1 by z minus x and here y minus z okay up to here after this minus we have to write here and we have to take lcm and what is the lcm here x minus y x minus y common factors we have to take first of all x minus y x minus y so we can write x minus y after that uh, y minus z here is y minus z and last here you can see y minus z so we can write here again y minus z again here is z minus x and here also z minus x so we can write here z minus x okay these are the lcm after this what we have to do we have to divide the denominator here is x minus y x minus y cancel both same factors so cancel z minus x z minus x also cancel what is remaining y minus z we have to multiply by one we have to multiply by numerator when you multiply by numerator what we can write here y minus z only because when you multiply by any number by one it will be same so here is plus so plus now we have to divide uh, denominator again uh, y minus x minus y x minus y cancel y minus z y minus z also cancel what is remaining z minus x multiply by one so we can write here z minus x plus so plus again we have to divide this z minus x z minus x cancel y minus z y minus z also cancel what is remaining x minus y multiply by 1 and we can write here x minus y after this let's open the bracket here x minus y y minus z z minus x okay up to here after that open the bracket y minus z plus z minus x plus x minus y now here y is negative positive and here is negative so we can cancel 
here minus z plus z one negative one positive so this also cancelled here minus x plus x this two one positive and another one is negative so we can cancel it so what is remaining here minus zero by x minus y y minus z and z minus x so zero by any number or any factors or any variable is equal to zero so answer of this question is zero hope you understand this question we have a next question you can see here 1 by x minus 3 x minus 5 plus 1 by x minus 3 x minus 1 leave it now you can see here here is x minus 3 here also x minus 3 okay the factor will be same if not we have to take minus common and we have to make it same like before here is x minus 5 here also x minus 5 okay here is x minus 1 and here also x minus 1 it means no need to arrange anything just we have to take LCM and what is the LCM here while taking LCM first of all we have to take common factor here is x minus 3 x minus 3 so we can write x minus 3 x minus 5 x minus 5 we have to write x minus 5 don't write double time x minus 5 x minus 5 if common we have to write only one times and then remaining we have to take after that x minus 1 x minus 1 so we have to write here x minus 1 after this we have to divide the denominator when you divide the denominator x minus 3 x minus 3 cancel x minus 5 x minus 5 also cancelled what is remaining x minus 1 we have to multiply by numerator with 1 so we can write here x minus 1 similarly plus so plus we have to write now again we have to divide the denominator x minus 3 x minus 3 cancelled x minus 1 x minus 1 cancel what is remaining x minus 5 multiply by 1 and we can write here x minus 5 here is minus so write on the minus again we have to divide the denominator and you can see here x minus 5 x minus 5 cancel x minus 1 x minus 1 also cancelled what is remaining x minus 3 multiply by 2 we have to multiply what is remaining whatever is remaining we have to multiply with numerator here this and this cancel this and this cancel what is remaining x minus 3 multiply by 2 so we can write here 2 x minus 3 hope you understand up to here after this open the bracket x minus 1 plus x minus 5 minus 2 into x 2x minus minus plus 3 into 2 6 by you can arrange this one x minus 1 x minus 3 x minus 5 after this here you can see x plus x 2x and here is a negative 2x so we can write minus 2x again you can see here minus 1 minus 5 minus minus plus so we have to add minus 1 minus 5 it will be minus 6 here is plus 6 so plus 6 by x minus 1 x minus 3 and x minus 5 after this you can see here one positive another is negative so we can remove this two also what is remaining here 0 by x minus 1 x minus 3 and x minus 5 is equal to 0 by any factor any variable any number it will be 0 only so 0 by this is equal to 0 so answer of this simplification is 0 hope you understand this question thanks for watching till last if you are new on my channel please uh, subscribe and hit the bell button so you will get the notification of upcoming videos too and don't forget to join my facebook page and facebook group uh, if you have any kind of question you can directly send me there or you can send me on whatsapp also which is given in description thanks for watching till last have a great day